Hello, welcome back to HWRadio.com. You're here with your main man, Hollywood. And it took off a couple days because I was just sitting back like, man, what would be the perfect show to do for these kids? These kids, I'm trying to reach these kids out here. And I'm going to tell y'all something because it seems like y'all got the power right now. So I'm going to tell y'all with the power that defunding the police would be one of the most stupidest ideas you can come up with. And you want to know why? Because I want you to put yourself in this situation. Defund your job. Defund your job meaning the worst come to worst is what you're expecting is that my wages is going to be cut. What I get to do extra on my job, my vacations, all that stuff's going to be cut and taken away from me. So in turn, what kind of attitude am I going to have when I go back to work? I'm going to have a either I don't care attitude, a shitty attitude, just like, man, I don't even think there'll be any more good cops <laughs> if you defund the thing on police. This is what I try to tell you because, nigga, in McDonald's, in Burger King, in all these places where you like, man, I can't, I can't take these attitudes when I'm just taking my order. They act like they mad. Won't well, they just quit their job? That's gonna be the police. <laughs> Because, nigga, if I'm the employee at McDonald's and McDonald's gets defunded, somebody come in there talking about I want 20 cheeseburgers and 15 fries, some just fat, just obese person. Nigga, I'm going to be like, they don't even pay me enough to make that, man. I'm going to make that nigga five burgers and three fries, and I'm clocking out. Like, they don't pay me enough. That's the attitude that the police is going to have. When your tire or something happened bad to you, you your car just break down. You in the middle of the highway, the police is going to drive right around your car like, like, nigga, if I wasn't defunded, i will put the flashes out and get you help. But right now, they don't even pay me enough for this. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you, man, that's the attitude that's going to come with the defunding. And these is the wrong people that you won't defund it, the people that are here to help you. If anything, clean it up. Clean up the department. That's what you should want. Defunding, that sounds ridiculous and stupid. I'm going to just keep it honest with y'all. Only thing you going to do is make crime go through, through the roof. Nigga like, man, man, get that nigga. Nah, man, police right there. Man, they defunded. <laughs> they defunded right now, nigga. They don't care. And then, nigga, you got right in front of the police. And they just sitting there like, shouldn't, shouldn't have got us defunded. I'm just saying, it's going to be all bad for us. Just period, point blank. All bad. All bad for people who can't live like a cowboy. So that's going to be my message to the young world out there today because, man, I'm trying to tell you that's going to be the wrong thing you want to do if you food. So if you feel like you food and you can't make it in the jungle, nigga, you better vote for the police. I mean, nah, <laughs> you better vote for the police to be funded because the streets is going to eat you. But that's going to be the show for today. So hopefully y'all learn something, pass it along, or do something with it. But. I'm trying to tell y'all that's going to be the wrong idea. We're going to be like little Mexico over here. Like we're going to be hanging from telephone wires and all kinds of stuff. But I'm up out of here, man. Like, y'all do what y'all want to do. But like I said, I'm ready for whichever way y'all take it. But I'm trying to tell y'all it's the stupidest idea you could ever think of. I don't even know who is making the decisions and the demands for y'all. But y'all show riding with them without thinking. Because y'all sure didn't think this one out. But I'm out.